Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hope everyone is doing well. There have been rise in cases in Maharashtra and Kerala. Hope the situation remains under control in Goa. Make sure to wear your mask when you are out in public, even if you are vaccinated. Goa is also open for tourism. Going to Panjim to collect my sister. These beautiful fields in Giri look all green and happy. Lockdown and COVID situation has led people to work in the fields and revive their land. It's good to see Goans working in the fields, which means we will get more and more of local farm produce. Farming is also the primary occupation of Goans. This is one of my favorite cafes in Goa. If you're a Goan, then I'm sure you'll definitely know about this cafe. It was once upon a time a busy cafe with great vibe, but COVID has changed the scene for them, or in fact for almost all restaurants. Their donuts are hot selling, but I love their gooey chocolate brownie. It's so good. Do give it a try. Only if you're lucky enough, you'll find it there, cause they're always almost sold out. Anyways, we bought a bunch of things to eat on our way back home. We took the inside road from Giri fields where there is less traffic since its office hour the main highway is too busy. We stopped by this small garo. By the way, I love their tea here. They make this rose flavored tea and somehow I like it cause the aroma is so mild yet so soothing. We bought some bhajis here and finally went back home. These we brought from Baker Street, rest all the items we ate in the car after properly sanitizing our hands and the package. This is chocolate fudge and Bailey's cream pastry and cheesecake. I finished the entire Bailey's cream cheesecake. It was so good. And I love cheesecakes over normal cakes, sponge cakes.
bought this packet of gulab jamun from the brand called Bambino and there was an offer buy one get one free so we got uh, two packets for 130 rupees This is normal amul butter that we require on daily basis like for breakfast paneer from chitre this is chitre paneer is very soft and i prefer them over amul paneer and this was for rupees 70 and we bought two packs and then amul cheese slices these are very handy like you can just eat them with bread for breakfast Then we got this tar roti urad dal papad. These are local Goan chilies. These are called tar roti chilies uh, papad. This tastes really nice. These are uh, thicker than a normal papad and more spicy. Then we have this chakri from Josh Joshi Farsan. This was nice and crunchy. and a bit spicy it was for around 53 rupees i love the flavor and it was really crunchy nice for tea time snacks i bought these kiwis uh 3 kiwis for 85 rupees uh from bagayaddar uh these were really nice and uh, sweet uh, basically when you buy from the market uh, they are not that sweet but these were luckily very sweet Then we got this gauti chewda from Umarie uh, Farsan. So this was also very good. Uh, this company is, I think, from Bicholim. Bicholim, that is. Uh, yes, it was for forty-two rupees. And what this random thing called as amla candy, uh, which my mom loves, she got it for herself. It was for around fifty rupees. Yes, fifty rupees, and it tastes really good. You can have it as mukhwas after food. Uh, masala banana wafers from Umarie again. This brand is really good. I love all their products. Like whatever I've tried till date, and you can find this brand in uh, Bagaida <coughs> Bazaar. These are button mushrooms. Uh, normally, these packets are priced at rupees fifty-five or fifty. You get it in the local market, but at Bagayadar, uh, we bought it for rupees thirty-eight, which is a sale deal. So yes, um, and I love mushrooms. But this uh, jira samba rice or ghee rice, I don't know. I just found this uh, ghee rice. Uh, interesting. Like I wanted to try ghee rice recipe, so that's why I bought this. Let's see how it tastes. Might share the recipe as well. It was priced at rupees one thirty, and uh, it's a product of Telangana, I guess. Yes. Next up, we have this three-in-one cutter, uh, which has two blades. One is for chopping vegetables, and the other one is for whisking egg. It also comes with a lid in which you can store food items and then cover it and keep it in the refrigerator. It was priced at around six twenty-five, and we got it for three seventy.